Okay. Welcome to episode two of Pablo, Linda, and Eric's science experiments. We have acquired a bubble maker. Um, and what we want to do is figure out whether or not what happens with bubbles and extreme cold. Okay, so we're going to go out from the station to the beer can. Focus. Which is also known as the vertical tower. Woo! Where it is much colder than it is in the station. Okay, now step number one. Let's see. Let's find a place where we can fire this off. Okay, here we are, ready for take one of the bubble machine. And the bubbles are bubbling, definitely bubbling. They continue. They get foggy though. They are getting foggy. Let me see yeah. if I can get up. Now we're gonna let it cool, then let it hit our hand. And we've had a couple of them fracture just like that one. So in fact, they are freezing. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna go down and wait a little. Wow. And we have frozen bubbles hanging from the railing. Let's see if we can zoom in on this. Keep it in focus now. We're not really in focus. Let's get in close there. So these are frozen bubbles that touched the railing and just froze in place. I'm to reach in and pop the, the, one of these bubbles here. Yeah, I can show what happens to it. Wow. It won't die. <laughs> so there are the bubbles going up. As they go down, they turn opaque. And they just keep going down. Some of them are actually breaking when they hit things, but as they break, they're staying intact. That is unreal. That's sweet. Here are a few that we'd done just a little bit earlier. Let's see how they've sort of frozen in place. Well, that was tons of fun. Now we're going to go outside and see if there's a difference in how the bubbles work. Let's see, where shall we do this? Let's, let's go out in the sun here. Okay. And Eric's ready to flip the switch on the back. It may need to be aimed downwind. I wonder if it's frozen up. So we've retreated to the warmth of the logistics arch indoors. So our bubble machine is completely frozen over here. Eric's catching some and they're just rolling along. Well, our bubble machine is pretty much out of it now. Frozen up again. And we've frozen bubbles. So, with the help of Eric and Linda, neither of whom are in focus because my autofocus is frozen, we have uh, um, unbusted a myth. <laughs>